Much like Microsoft Excel, Google Spreadsheets has a number of ways in which you can use functions to manipulate your data. In this particular video, we'll cover some of the most basic functions that you might find yourself using for Google Spreadsheets. The easiest way to get to functions in Google Spreadsheets is to click the Functions button in the right-hand side of the toolbar at the top of the screen. Here you'll see some of the most common functions that you are most likely to use. Let's go ahead and try the SUM function. If we click SUM, Google now asks us what our starting value should be. So here we're going to enter B2, that's the starting number. Then we'll separate it by a colon, and then we want to also put what the ending number is. So here we'll have B3. If there were more cells, we would just go ahead and put that corresponding cell number. So if I hit enter, it will now add 1500 and 1200 together to get me 2700. If I wanted to subtract those two numbers, it's a little tricky because in Excel and in Google Spreadsheets, there is no subtraction function. So we would still use the SUM function, and instead now we can put B2 minus B3. And here we have 300. So when you need to subtract, still use the SUM function. And lastly, we'll go ahead and cover average. So if we click average, we can again put B2 as our starting number, colon, B3 as our ending number, and hit enter. And here we have 1350. There are plenty of other functions that you can explore in here. Max will tell you the highest number in a given column, and minimum will tell you the minimum number in the column. Count will also tell you how many numbers total or how many things are counted in that particular column.